So guys, I am back with another Power World video and today guys, I bring you the one month mark an update from the game's community manager talking about the game itself, the future and more. Let's go. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and I'm giving away a couple of copies of this game or if you have this game already any game of your choice to be in the chance of winning simply drop a like on this video leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed with those notifications turned on the winners are picked from the comments section and announced at the end of the week so good luck everybody okay so bucky the community manager at pocket pair the community manager of power world and craftopia put out a statement yesterday in regards to the one month mark of power world's release where he actually mentions how Power has lost some of its players, states how new content will come and more. Now, what I will say is Bucky, I actually spoke to before this game's release. I mean, yeah, for sure, I knew about Power World, but I wasn't really planning on covering it. I planned on playing it, but I wasn't really planning on covering it. I shot him a DM and he instantly replied to me and gave me an early access code. It was just like that. I mean, the dude's an absolute legend. And I see him day and night trying to interact with people on Twitter. His DMs are open, but they're being absolutely spammed, as you can imagine. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if he's turned them off. You cannot DM this dude anymore because he must be getting bombarded from people who are enjoying this game like I was. And I told him before release because uh, I had a week's early access thanks to this dude. I told him how amazing this game is and how people absolutely love it. And to be honest, I don't think he actually believed that point and within this statement he pulled out on twitter yesterday i mean he even says himself that he didn't expect it to more or less go past the 50,000 player mark i mean what we at now it's 20 plus million i mean that's unreal it really is so yeah congrats to him so yeah the statement bucky put out yesterday you can see on screen now with Power World quickly approaching the one month mark, it's interesting to look back at my own thoughts for launch. In May of 2023, I was convinced that Power World could break the 50,000 player mark. Anything above that seemed unobtainable though, and I certainly never expected it to reach into the millions. I mean, let's be real guys, I mean, this game took off. I mean, it took off like it had a rocket up its ass. Now, I know many people will say it's because there's a dry period in gaming, which I kind of semi-agree. For me personally, I wasn't really enjoying any game at the minute besides Cyberpunk, which I'd played and completed about 20 times over. So I really was looking for that next adventure. I didn't think it was going to be Power World in a million years. I'm so glad it is. But I actually feel this game, not only did it hit at the right time, but I also think it's because that we're so used to these AAA games releasing and absolutely failing when a game that comes out and it's in early access and it's like half the price of these AAA games and it fills so many holes people have in regards to what they look for in a game plus let's just say it is like Pokemon with guns a Pokemon game, an open world Pokemon game an open world Pokemon game where you can roam freely build bases, do what you gotta do, catch, breed craft all that good stuff i mean most gamers knew way prior to power world if a game like this ever released through the love and want that people have just for have a pokemon game like this we knew that a game like power world would absolutely explode probably not to the actual extent it has done but even still we knew it would explode and that's exactly what's happened so yeah he goes on to say it's taken years to get to this point and power world only really begins from here this is great news guys obviously everyone is working hard to fix the issues and prepare new content and pals some of you may have had your fun over the last three weeks and found yourself putting the game down that is fine which i do completely agree it's absolutely fine to put this game down and either take a break play something else in fact this is definitely the right thing to do I also want to talk about the point of him stating that the team is working hard to fix the issues. Now, I play on PC. I mean, I've I play on my own server, obviously. I ain't going into the official servers yet. But I understand on Xbox, it's an absolute nightmare for many, many players. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping that the team is working super, super hard to fix the many issues that's going on over there. Because although the majority of the player base is on PC, 
that definitely doesn't excuse the point the game is on Xbox and should play as sound as it does on PC. So hopefully they get these issues sorted. Okay, so he goes on to say, this emerging power world has lost so and so of its player base. This course is lazy, but it's probably also a good time to step in and reassure those of you capable of reading past the headline that it's fine to take breaks from games. As I just said, he then says you don't need to feel bad about that. I agree. Power World, like many games before it, isn't in a position to pump out massive amounts of new content on a weekly basis. Further on this point, I don't think anyone expects it to be. I mean, there's plenty of content in this game already. I mean, small updates every here and there, and the updates they can do, the implements they can do, and incorporate into a game like this could be absolutely massive for what we want in a game like this anyway. So I'm happy to leave it in their capable hands. I'm going to be super patient. I know when these updates do eventually come in regards to new content, they will be absolutely amazing. He goes on to state new content will come and it's going to be awesome. But these things take a little bit of time, which obviously we all understand this. What I'd also state is as well, which is something he said earlier on in the post, that basically he expected about that 50k player mark. They didn't expect the millions and millions of players. I think that's hit them by surprise for sure. But I think now they understand they're in a position where they can make even more money off this. This game could last many, many years with the right updates. And I genuinely do think this is what they would do. In fact, let's be real here. It'd be absolutely stupid if they didn't do this, if they didn't follow up with new content. They've just dropped one of the biggest games I can remember in my lifetime. A game millions of players not only brought, but absolutely loving. And I don't for one second think it's ending anytime soon. So he goes on to say there are some amazing games out there to play. You don't need to feel guilty about hopping from game to game. As I said earlier, it's actually good to hop from game to game, trust me. So if you're still playing Power World, we love you. If you're no longer playing Power World, we still love you. And we hope you'll come back for round two when you're ready. Play lots of games, try different genres, and frequently flick through indie libraries to find hidden gems. I also agree with him on this statement. Some of the best games I've found have been hidden gems. In fact, I feel before the release of Power World, many people like myself, other gamers out there, you guys out there, would have looked at this and thought to yourself, this could be a hidden gem. And that's more or less exactly what this game is. It is that hidden gem. It's that game no one expected to absolutely obliterate records and sales across the board. And I must say, it is truly deserved. Pocket Pair probably sitting there thinking, now why didn't we sell it for 10 bucks more? We could have made millions, millions more, which I agree, but hey ho, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm pretty sure they're super happy with the sales this game has made. I know they're super happy with their partnership with Microsoft. Hopefully they can get the game fixed over there on Xbox as soon as possible. But yes, guys, a quick little update from Bucky, the community manager on Power World itself. As he says, new things are coming. We just got to be patient. So yes, guys, let's be patient and enjoy what we have. If you're not enjoying it and you're getting a bit bored, go ahead and play other games. It's cool to take breaks, as I said and as he said. So yes, guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.